we see you at least getting out there a little bit. Just how does it feel just to be kind of back doing a few things out with the guys and uh, on the board a little bit? After being out so long, it's kind of weird, you know, just, you know, training your body back, you know, to doing the things that he's doing before, getting a routine. So, I mean, but right now it's progressing really well. Um, you know, it feels good to be out here, you know, just getting up and down a little bit with the guys on certain drills. But, you know, just got to continue to take it day to day. Are you kind of, is it just little by little right now? Just yeah, you don't want to you don't want to overdo it. You know, our um, progression rate has been really tremendous. Um, while guys on the road trip, you know, had tremendous drives, you know, was doing a lot more running, a lot more, you know, stuff on the Alter G treadmill just to, you know, get back mobility and get back into the you know, kind of a groove. And you know, just getting out here, you know, shooting with the guys, you know, things are you know, starting to show. Are you able to stay engaged with the team when you're not traveling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I have someone here that stays with me, and you know, I watch you know pretty much all the games, and you know just you know we always have been you know in communication just to make sure everyone's on the same page even while they're gone. Crosses like this can be frustrating, especially the longer ones. How have you been able to kind of I don't know, mentally handle this? Man, it's a grind. It's part of it's part of it. You know, you just gotta stay focused. You can't get discouraged because the minute you start getting discouraged, that's when you're not focused in on what you're doing to try and get back. And then your time, your recovery time is a lot longer. So you know, mentally, you just gotta be locked in. Like you said, it is frustrating not being out there with your, your guys. You know, competing, in, but you gotta make sure you want to be out there fully healthy. You know, not just being out there half. You know, and not giving it your all. So you know, it, it's that's what kind of keeps me focused in. You know, getting back there. You know, fully with everyone even more frustrating, I guess, when losses are coming and you feel like you could make a big difference? Absolutely, absolutely. You know, just the impact, you know, feeling like you can do so much with the team and, you know, help your team, you know, help your guys in so many ways. You know, just, you know, just sitting there watching, you see certain things, you know, on the court, you know, you can't do nothing about it. So, you know, you can communicate things, but being out there is different. Are you at a point now where it's like almost healed or you're just trying to ramp up? I'm just, I'm just trying to, you know, take it day to day. The better, the more I feel each and every day, I do more things. Um, just, ba just basically go from there. Not, you know, doing too much at once because I don't want to, uh, you know, overdo it and overcompensate things. So it's basically a day to day thing. Just, you know, amp it up. The better I feel, the more and more I would do. With a bone bruise, it is kind of an ambiguous timetable. Did you talk to anyone over the course who's had a similar injury? Just yes, kind of I have. Like I have. I've talked to a couple people, um, and people have just told me that it's something that you got to really just lock in and do your recovery on. Um, you know, it, it's no real timetable because they're so they're so unfortunate and so nagging. But like they're they're weird because there's no timetable you can set up and play. It's just basically how you feel. So. It was like just make sure that you continue to, you know, take your rehab very seriously, no days off. And even when you not feeling good, you still gotta come in and work. Have you seen differences with this team? You haven't played under Ryan, but what changes have you seen him implement from a coaching style standpoint? Playing a lot faster, um, shooting a lot of threes, um, trying to pause our will more and um, like I said, just playing with, with more pace, trying to, you know, get up the court twenty two seconds, you know, by half court. So a lot of things is, you know, just changing the, the way we play and like getting a lot more shots. When you're back, do you think it's going to be a lot faster having, or not just you, but everyone back? Like it's, it hasn't been a huge jump in pace yet, but that's kind of maybe been because of the injuries? Yeah, yeah. Once everyone's back healthy, you know, we got good bodies out there. Everyone, I think it, that, that'll help the pace because the guys are not, you know, playing extended amount of minutes the way they're playing now because, like you said, we're so depleted uh, just for guys with injuries. But, you know, we're gradually getting everyone back. And, you know, it's a good thing. The more bodies you have, the more you can sit up and you can rest different guys and, you know, you can get more out of people. Covey, you know Dario well. I mean, do you think kind of, is he one of those guys that now that he's in the starting lineup, does that give him a little extra bounce in his step or? Uh, yeah, like it will. Yeah. It will. You know, he, he's been a starter, you know, it's pretty much his whole career in Philly with me. Um, and it gives him a better feel for the game, you know, coming off the bench. He hasn't been used to that. So I think it was just, you know, an adjustment for him in the beginning. But you know, I think it will help him. It's just, you know, like you said, getting out to that early bounce and, you know, getting in the rhythm early. Do you feel like you're getting closer cover? Do you think it's still maybe a little ways out? Uh, I honestly don't, couldn't even tell you. Um, over all-star break, you know, I, I'm not going nowhere. Uh, I'm going to go back to Nashville and rehab and just continue to you know, make the stri strides in the right direction because, like I said, I want to be back, you know, completely healthy once I, you know, do finally come back.